Hello, my lovely Aries. How are you, loves? I hope everyone is doing well. Aries, welcome to December readings. This is the second series for December. And in this reading, we are looking who is coming towards you, what is on the way, and what else we need to pay attention that is coming forward. We are in a Sagittarian season and... Most importantly, I do record this right before Sagittarius' new moon. So let's see here, Aries, what do we have for you that is on the way forward. And of course, I want to say thank you for all of you who come in and into new these energies. The Wheel of Fortune. Whatever it's on the way to you, it's quite destined. When we have the Wheel of Fortune for anyone or comes in the reading, very strongly speaks of no matter whatever you think or whatever you want out of something, know that that's destined. And it seems here for many, many areas, money coming in, for others of you, there is family, but I feel here there is a situation here it starts to pick up beautifully. You know, Wheel of Fortune and Ten of Pentacles for some of you. Definitely you might have a bonus at work. For others of you, there is a situation here which were very unstable or needed to be stable. It's getting better. And it seems here that took quite a while. You've been waiting for quite a while for whatever it's on the way. For some of you, there is a family situation out there. So if you want to resolve a conflict of any kind or, or something between you and a family member needs to be resolved, believe it or not, whatever you've been waiting, it's coming. For some of you, yes, you, you've been waiting for a return. There's a monetary return. You loan some money to someone those money are coming but it seems here that it's for a very long time and also feels here that yes you get it but with the six of pentacles very strongly speaks that I want the way I give it to you so something here it's still kind of like I expect it differently to come this return or this sum of money. So definitely here, certain things here, you are on the wait. Hangman, Tower, Seven of Pentacles, Seven of Cups, and the Judgment. Look at this, three major arcanas, and the fourth we have the Wheel. So definitely a situation here feels like takes forever or took forever and for some of you may may feel like whatever didn't move now it's moving quite fast because the tower feels like everything is breaking down i've been waiting for so long and now like everything come like one after another one and you you're probably a little confused I don't know what to do. I don't know what's best to do. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Seven of Cups very strongly that whatever is going on here, it's kind of bringing you that burst. But it seems like somehow it's way too much, way too big. Because, you know, sometimes when things are not happening or things are going in delay or very slow, and over the sudden, everything starts like one after another one because, you know, when it's raining, it's pouring because, yes, and that is regards even though when things are going good, even though are not good. But yes, and the Judgment and Tower, both of them are awakening cards. In an instant, I knew it or in an instant comes to me. The Seven of Cups clarifier, justice, another major, goodness. So whatever here, it's on the way, really needed to be balanced. That's the Six of Pentacles and the, and the Libra energy of the justice is being served. 
is to your surprise for some of you you get an answer from someone and it's kind of like finally this is is there the tower moment here speaks of four of pentacles something here feels like too much i don't know i don't know so see here four and six again family energy money energy here and the tower clarified by four of pentacles feels like a little too much or a little over the 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 border the hangman clarifier we have ten of wands yes seems here for for many many of you aries whatever comes into you it's a clearing energy it's a new beginning as well for some of you whatever here was very hard to achieve now it is paid off your hard work is paid off and for those of you who fell stagnant into a situation now that stagnation is going away even though you feel like ah, so much all in once and kind of whatever brings to you it's quite unbelievable look at this chariot the the judgment here very much speaks like pay attention you are not stuck actually you are on a move and this is who you are this is how the things gotta be so for many many areas a period of stagnation for some of you could be a period of two years of stagnation for others of you four years and for others a little longer but i feel here like now it's a breakthrough into the move and could be also the stagnation for some of you regards a family situation could be a love situation for others of you could be a money situation like you always thought you you work so much for so less and now like your appreciation it's unbelievable beautiful and the move it's quite awesome the six of pentacles clarified by nine of wands and the strength you you knew i need to fight for whatever it's mine because strength very strongly speaks of whatever you you've been through whatever you feel through it's kind of shape you into the new areas okay loves so your shape shifter energy here it's happening and there is a lot a lot of movement so from being stagnant to it's kind of unstoppable move forward and a lot of things here that were up in the air kind of like start to take counter and now you see like oh now i know what i needed to do now i know what needed to happen now i know what i needed to hold on and what i don't need to hold on for some areas there is you and someone in your family that now you kind of like part away yes it's a dear individual it's a dear person but i feel here now you are clearly know to move on from whatever it is and not getting you know back off so yeah a lot of movement so that's on the way to you loves i don't see for some of you could be a leo for some of you could be a sag pisces scorpio libra cancerian energy here so these are the zodiac signs I feel here you might deal with. But I don't see, um, sometimes we do see in the readings a specific person you are dealing. But I feel here this is some kind of situation you've been for quite a while. The best advice, loves, we have Knight of Cups, Eight of Swords star and king of wands and look at this world 
there's a chapter in your life you are closing and clearly there's something new coming in as well I have Aquarius energy but from a situation when you felt locked in or you felt stuck it's kind of like now I know that was very much on my decision to take action forward to move forward so Aries I feel here very strongly speaks of this is it all what you need to do is to give yourself that opportunity to get out from that energy I'm not good enough but I really want it go ahead loves and since is a new moon week I have the moonology deck for advice from the oracles and yeah look at this loves full moon in Capricorn card the end of a tough cycle approach so definitely here it is a cycle for for many areas that is at the end and underneath we have waxing crescent moon have faith in your dream so your dreams need faith from you and of course I feel here for some of you as we moving into the full moon in Cancerian into the the month of into the month of Capricorn into the month of uh, January 2023rd you will see a lot a lot of movement especially from whatever you've been dealing for quite a while but that's over we have full moon in Capricorn full moon in Capricorn is happening in in the month of July but we do have a swell chariot here so very strongly speaks of whatever it's here it's it's changing and it's moving away so lovely Aries that's what we have for you darlings I hope this resonates with you and whatever comes to words love and light many blessings bye for now